Okay, welcome to Electron Online and to further illustrate how you work out a problem, the number of permutations when there's so, uh, X number or N number of people sitting around the table, we're going to do another example where we can illustrate again where the first person can sit anywhere and it really doesn't matter. For example, if the first person sits over here or there or there or there or there or there, it really makes no difference. You plop down the first person somewhere around the round table and it doesn't matter where around the round table because from the geometry of a circle it really doesn't make any difference. Now where the other four, in this case, the other three people are placed, that makes a difference because that's going to be relative to the first person. So therefore the, the number of permutations is n minus 1 factorial. So in this case with four people you're going to have, let's see here, this is equal to 4 minus 1 factorial which is 3 factorial which is equal to 6 different permutations and here you can then easily see since there's only so many people on this table you can see that for example you have 2, 3 and 4 and you can have let's say a relative to number 1 the next person can be uh, 2 and then we have 4 and 3 and then if 1 is there so then you see the next person instead of making that a 2 I can make that a 3 and then a 2 and a 4 and then here 1 make that a 3 and a 4 and a 2 and then finally so we went from 1 to 2 1 to 2 1 to 3 1 to 3 and I'm notice I'm going the same direction in this case counterclockwise doesn't really matter so 1 to 4 4 that can become 2 and 3 and go from 1 to 4 3 and 2 and notice those are the six permutations that you can have again the best way to think about it is start at number one go either clockwise or counterclockwise it doesn't really matter I, I wouldn't decide to go counterclockwise, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 4, 3, 1, 3, 2, 4, 1, 3, 4, 2, and then 1, 4, 2, 3, and 1, 4, 3, 2. Those are the six permutations. Again, the number of permutations can be determined with the simple formula, and that's how that works.